not. That's. <laughs> I did almost win you the game on that shit. <laughs> what if he just removed his arm halfway through or his hand? Sorry. Yeah. I was. I. I yeah. like how I was just about to tell Jim, I was like, God damn, I got these great corners and they're not playing up to their potential. And then he throws three picks to him. I was like, all right, nice. Hey, everybody, it's the coach. This is the NFL on EA Sports. Straight ahead with four, four, four interceptions. Good yeah. Between the Miami Dolphins <laughs> and the Indianapolis Colts. All right. <laughs> uh, maybe I should with try and truck stick. Stream is up, baby. We bring in our broadcasters. Brandon got it. <laughs> oh, yeah, he dotted me the fuck up. Coach, as we welcome all of you to our exclusive coverage of the National Football League. Are you playing the, are you playing the Chargers? Like the in, the, in the league? NFL game, and that oh, okay. was in evidence a moment ago. Fireworks, pyrotechnics, you name it. This all right, boys. The Finns are ready to so get this fine. shit. Huh? The Miami Dolphins and the Indianapolis Colts. Hey. Hey, where's my man Bruce Irvin? We need another speech, bro. <laughs> he did. He got a pick last game. I like how Derek was talking mad shit about him. Last week's win was indicative of how good this team can be. He did. You said he, you said he sucked, and then he got a pick like right after that. <laughs> That's not what. They were losers their last time out. They're gonna try to get back in the win column, but obviously they're gonna have to do that in a hostile environment. And sometimes it actually works to your advantage. Now you've got a band together. Oh no! Oh shit! Against the I just realized we get to play against oh, Levy on the Well, Levy on Bell's about to get catch the ultimate disrespect. Got to stop the run, boys. Two touchdowns, an interception. Yeah, you know, he wants to increase that a little bit in terms of ratio. But first and foremost, they did win the game. Now the first carry for Le'Veon Bell. Only a couple for him there on the game's first play, and it's second down. And we look now at the offense for Indianapolis. Brian Kelly's I don't know why he just kicks me from the party. The mm. A former first-round pick. He was yeah. plugged in immediately to be a starter to handle big nose tackles as well as blitzing linebackers and also able to move and get out into the run game. I'm, and get to the I'm mad that they're going to have to wait till fucking Wednesday. Now a draw play. This is Bell. And the second wave of Should've tacklers is going to get him as they stop him behind the line. The tally there minus I'm two good. yards. I'm going century late. <laughs> nice play right there to stop him behind the line, but I want to see how this defense continues to play him here. In the you should have been like CenturyLink yeah, said they're going to come out tomorrow. What up? <laughs> what are you going to do? So what do you do? Yeah, I think you have to make sure that you bottle him in. <laughs> also true. Levels. Because if you crowd Karen's okay though. The line of scrimmage, if he breaks through, it's nothing but room to run. He gets it to Brown. Good play. Oh my God! Who is this receiver? Get out of my you piece of shit! Executed 22 yard gain. Oh, it's Antonio Brown. Drove it with excellent pace. Money throw right there to Tony Brown. Tony Brown's out here giving me that work. First down, Brissett. It's complete here to T.Y. Hilton. And he'll take it down shy of the 45 at the 46. One Who? thing we do know, he's going to get his catches. So if they Man, we was fucking Kareem up. You gotta continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the second day. This is Bell, and the reinforcements come in as they're gonna stop him behind. The Let's line. go, Le'Veon Bell's got That's negative go five yards, baby. Five, and it brings up third down. All right, Hooper, this is you. Oh shit, this is King. Let's like, go, pick. Picked up by Tease Tabor, and his guys are going to take over. I see you, Tease. Teasy Tabes. Nice. They told us repeatedly earlier <laughs> in the week in our meetings, we need some plays from our defense here on the road. That's early. what they, they got one. And don't think they were above all week long pointing out to their defense that the other defense is where Oh, they're yeah. Running. Oh, and yeah. That Hines first carry. To touchdown. And all the way in for a Miami <laughs> touchdown. Hey, let's go. His first touchdown on the year. 
Oh. Oh. Hey, we picked up Hines first. Brita injured. No. Well, that's how you take advantage of an early He's holding his knee. A sudden change situation, oh. meaning balls turned over. <laughs> How's both sides going to handle it? One side Let's go. Win. That's what we needed. Right we traded for it. The end zone. One play. That just added insult to injury. Yeah, traded for a spark out here, boys. Traded for a spark. Going over there. Go. You know that now. Hey, send him, to a, send him to a place that wins in the division over here. <laughs> that's not you. <laughs> <laughs> Send it to a team that's undefeated. <laughs> the kickoff unit is out on the Hey, we just had a, a we just traded away. for Hines, man. He's a beast. <laughs> this is taken at the three. He's a beast too. <laughs> He's better than Derek's receiver. <laughs> The Colts offensive unit ready to see what they can do here. They had the interception last time and led to the <laughs> opening Henry touchdown. My so world, now 7 nothing to score as they start first and 10. <laughs> and Phil Rivers just throws fucking dots, too. Just a yard on the first down carry, so it's second and nine. A look now at our starting defense. They enter play here, number 11, just outside the top 10 of the league in stopping the run. I jotted down in my notes and prepping for Atta this. a kid! This definitely an area we got to keep an eye on because you talk about where they Two run. out here with another touchdown. Run. But how about what they're facing? Woo. This unit loves to run the football, and they rank highly in the league in getting it done. Yeah, power against power. Who's eating the ho ho Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. I know. <laughs> on second down now. <laughs> oh, honey, run him so. a couple up to about the 30. One thing to keep in mind, partner, especially in the second half, when you've got a running back of this size and these dimensions, I can just tell you, attrition does set in for a defense because you're excited about hitting him in the first half. Maybe not so much in the second half, and some of these shorter gains turn into bigger runs later. The Dolphins get there this time, and they bring him down. Christian Wilkins with a big-time sack on third down. It's a loss of seven. Now that was just absolute perfect man coverage. Nowhere for them to go with the football led to a sack. And that's really difficult to do in today's NFL with all these gazelles running around that you're trying to cover in the secondary. <laughs> nice job oh. bringing that one back. 14. Is he, is he still, still X Factor? It'll be Dolphin football. <laughs> Out comes the Miami offense. Oh, we're eating him up then. To take over. Yep, 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 yep. Last drive, one play on the ground, all the way to the. Oh yeah, I gotta give Gus the bus his 12 carries. Partner, I love your description because when we talk about hitting the home run, we're usually thinking about a passing. Add a kid. Something in the air, deep ball. All right. but Fourth and 14. Big time, John. Now, if you're coming back out, now they've established this run game. The play action pass could very well be open. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. What score? Okay. First carry now for Gus Edwards. And he'll be taken down right around the 34 after a pickup. Oh, Bree got yard. hurt. That means I don't have to give him his thing. And the big fella <laughs> stuffed that one up in a big way. Yeah, he's gonna be real pissed. Oh, he should be pissed about the next level if you don't take care of him first. It's complete to Grant. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the 45. That one good. Oh, they got Ziggy Onzo over here. First down. Cool under pressure right there, escaping the pocket Ooh, and finding what I think was not very. his primary target. And some of these guys are just so comfortable. Outside of he gets real wild. Who the, like, the fuck is this dude? Really <laughs> Just I, they move and they know it affects the defense because a lot of times he, you get and he knocked the pass down. That's what I'm real upset about. Exactly right. Wasn't his primary target. Found a secondary guy who sprang open, probably because oh. of his movement out of the pocket. Man, Danny Trevathan there to bring him down. If you would have got it, it was rough for us too. Run sets up a very manageable second down, a very solid gain on that play. Draw play. This is Hines. Try to find a lane, but instead he'll get back to the line. No. And no more. They'll say no gain on the play there, and now it'll be third down. My quarterback's injured too. My backup. Yeah, I tried to run a. From the gun on third down. Pants, yeah. On a fourth and one. And that is incomplete. 
<laughs> you can tell they were hoping for a flag there offensively. Several on the sideline motioning. Hey, why not a penalty? Why not a penalty? I, what did you see? Yeah, I think you've got to let them play, and the officials are instructed if there's contact Ooh, pick six. from both sides, no flag. Let them fight. Yeah. The forces fourth down. So they're going to come to the line here, and it appears trying to go for it on fourth. Taysom Hill does. They'll try and throw for it to Jackson. <laughs> I like it. Oh, it's been oh my backup! Oh shit! Derek King just torched bicep. <laughs> now I gotta go get a backup because uh, House does not the call. I actually will. <laughs> what do you want for him? Hey, go get Ryan Fitzpatrick. He's a great mentor. Now it's Hines. Let me think. Let me see what draft picks I have. And there we saw one of the downsides of blitzing during a That's run down. I literally just want it for the meme. Gaps. You don't fit the run quite as well because you're headed towards the ball carrier with abandon. From the 25 on second down, <laughs> Jackson eluding the pressure right. He gets it into the arms of Parker, complete. Six <laughs> yards to pick up, and that's a first down. As a general rule, offensive linemen like to know where their quarterback's going to be when they're setting up to throw the football. But sometimes they just have to get on the run, get on the yeah. move. He's able to do he that on that play and picks up a first down with a nice throw. And a <laughs> game here of nine from the 19 Keenan to Allen. the 10. A nice run there, nine yards, and it'll be second down. On second down, it's Edwards. And this time he's not going anywhere. They'll get him down right at the line of scrimmage. Doubling this guy has to be a priority before moving up to the next level because the big fella, he just ate that one alive, just stuffed it. In fact, before the game. And this is caught by Parker for a Miami touchdown. Uh, hey, I almost forgot about giving Parker his catches. <laughs> His second touchdown on the season. And the Dolphins are able to extend that advantage. What score? 14 7. A nice throw there oh, by shit. the second year quarterback. And I don't believe that was the kind of play he would have made as a rookie. Because usually your rookie season Moss. is a continuation of your college days. A lot of one read, and if you don't have it, you just take no. it off and go. Now he's settled in the pocket a little bit more. <laughs> reading That's the a real field, Josh Allen to stat second line. And sometimes third progression. That was a nice play. <laughs> well, you got Nathan Peterman out there or something? And this will be a <laughs> touchback as that sails over the end line. And now Indianapolis set to take the field. And they're in a bind early here, down 14-0. Are you worried at this stage or still too early? You're worried. You're just trying not to transmit it to the rest of your team. Oh! You make sure that they stay positive. Le'Veon Bell but shook five time, people in the hole. How are we going to move the football? What do we have on this play sheet that can work? I was real nervous. Get back to basics is usually your answer. And make sure you find the guy who can move the ball fastest for you if you just get it in his hands. Yeah, still second quarter. You get points on the board here i think you're feeling okay two minutes <laughs> to play first half it's 14 to nothing your team's a bunch of mcdubers coming up at the half we'll join who charles the coach <laughs> the coach jonathan coachman standing by in orlando he lets nowhere to escape and he goes down christian wilkins picks up his second sack of the afternoon <laughs> Here's Brissett. This will be caught by Brown. And he will have... No! As they get him to the ground at the 37. Tell that man to retire. To throw is Brissett. That's complete. It's Bell. It'll be a gain of nine. And it'll be second and about a yard to go for the first. That last catch short of the marker by just a yard leaves him with a very manageable second and one. Brissett now. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. The Colts that guy's still here. The first of their timeouts, as he'll stop it with exactly a minute to go before halftime. <laughs> he just, he just looks old. <laughs> he has a name that's old too. Avery. We're set from the gun on third. It's caught by Funches, <laughs> and he's able to get this one out closer to midfield across the 45. It'll be a game Watch out for the fake pump, boys. They like to run that weak a shit. Game that doesn't get them the first down brings up a fourth down situation. Really nice job defensively. They knew where the sticks were. They got the stop before. <laughs> Good one, boy. Let's go. Let's go. 
Is that young Hoku? The Dolphins offense <laughs> now heads back on the field. You've got under a minute to go here until halftime. You've got the good size lead. No need to do anything crazy. No, there really is no need to do anything <laughs> crazy. The spot play, go ahead and take your lead into the locker room. No! Grant got hurt. There's He's so fast. Grant. My receiver. Yeah. No! Jackson Bobo! <laughs> Maybe pressing De DeAndre Hopkins is going to be a bad idea. <laughs> well, he's he's a he's a ninety nine, so <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who? Green Hunt. The Colts beefing up the secondary. Six defensive backs in the game. <sighs> Yikes, bro! <laughs> Jackson from the shotgun. Yikes! Good catch. The rookie <laughs> with a great catch. I like it. You can't even get out of there running the ball because you're just going to fumble. But well, that's what you're looking for when you want to throw the ball downfield. Do you want one of those guys who can play out on the perimeter, can play out wide, who can not only he said, get open, so your team's a bunch of goober babies. Can uncover themselves downfield and create catches. And an alley to run. Oh, oh shit. Nice Why work to get seven out of that, and it's second down. The Dolphins going to take their second timeout. As he's they a, stop it with Because he's what you call a true the beast. First half of play. <laughs> <laughs> To throw again on second down. Jackson. That's complete to his tight end, Mike Gesicki. And they're able to work this to the 25 Ooh. before it's all said and done. Where's his brother? And offensively, they'll take the timeout with six seconds left in the second quarter. So even though it's first down, here's the field. Brown have this five now to try to get three before receptions yet. From the left hash, it's Good. a 42 yard attempt. And this will be off the right. Oh up. my god. I thought I missed that field goal. High degree of difficulty there. What hey, score you're getting, Tom? 17 0. It's now 17 0. Hit the inside, hit the inside, hit the inside of the upright, the right though. Upright, yeah, beating the shit the out of the Colts, bro. Yeah, he's a right footed kicker. I picked up Hines. <laughs> I picked up Hines, man. He's a beast. We actually have a run game. JJ <laughs> Watt just fucked up my right tackle. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchdown. Oh, and Ingram and Joey Bosa with the watch the locker room, and they're going to have some adjustments. Uh, X factors. Oh, a lot of people are thinking to themselves, all right. Take the knee, get out of here, regroup. But how no, do you coach and his staff approach halftime? Will it be angry? Will it be clinical? Will they be calm? Will they just fumble? Who knows? Brown, you God damn it, Brown, you wanted the ball now. and you're gonna right, fumble Randy, on me. We'll get back to you guys. Uh -oh. Fuck out of here. We got 98 yards passing, 98 yards rushing. Real balance we'll start attack. Our tour out in the city of Angels, Los Angeles. And it's the Patriots leading that one in the second quarter. Pick that. James White, a touchdown run in that first half. From there, we head east to Detroit to check on the Lions at home at Ford Field. And they were losers <laughs> in that one to the visiting Minnesota Vikings. 27 to 10, the final score. Finally, let's get right to the center of the U.S. map and check in on the Chiefs at home in Kansas City. And Broncos are 0 and 3. The God damn. Broncos at the half. The Chiefs locked in a tight one, but this is a game you feel they've got to have. Meanwhile, in our game, it's been a back and forth first half. Who can put it together in the second half? For the Derwin answer, is a we fucking dirtbag. We turn it back over to our broadcast <laughs> team, Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. He's a ma he's a ball magnet. He finds it. Right, he coach, hits it. Thank you. And we <laughs> welcome everyone back for quarter number three. The Dolphins in front, and they'll be in possession of the football first as the second half gets started. That'll be taken in the end zone. Bosa. And he'll take it back to about the 19 yard line. <laughs> Okay, 
comes the Dolphins now. They'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. And they split the uprights last time for three. They've got the lead. They're not going to play this conservative. They're, they're not hoping for another field goal. They're hoping for a touchdown. I'm with you on that one. I like where your head is. I like the way you're thinking because... Probably just got to run away from J.J. Watt. Just to be honest with you. Beast! Beast! Let's go, Hines! 100 yards? Nice! Exactly. Brito only, only has and try to increase your lead in a big way. And the best way to do it, twenty outs. Well, they put it all together on that one. Good vision, good blocking. A toss play to the left. How do you toss it? Uh, yeah, a toss. Man, the good thing we picked Hines up, man. We needed him for this game. You pitch it end over end, correct? Yeah, I, I, you're, you're the guy. Do not tumble, you piece of shit. Oh, hey, Gus. Gus doesn't look that bad either after, you know, when you get a real running back in there. Two is ten for ten. Ooh. Ooh. Man, you slow piece of shit. Good job, Jackson. No, bad job, boys. All right, let me go ahead and give Jackson his carries. That makes things very difficult, but when you're running a drag oh, run, we got a fly. Hey, they beat me bad. Actually, I think they beat And he gets it to the 34, good enough for the first. Give him the third down conversion. Five All right, Gus. Keep it up, bro. I see you working. Now. Here's first and ten. They'll go back to Edwards on first down. And they're going to stop him right at the line of scrimmage. Just no cutback lane to be found whatsoever. Second and ten. <laughs> so after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. Throwing is Jackson. Fuck. And his throw is going to be incomplete. And now offensive I got way too greedy on that play. Myself, actors always say, what's my motivation before a big scene? Right now, the play caller is thinking, what have I done before that's worked well that I can go to right now? Yeah, because they were pretty successful in the first half scoring points. Haven't done anything so far that's here a big in the football. second half. And now the third down throw incomplete as well. I know ultimately that feels like a good defensive play, but I know it's really not. They had a chance to keep points off the board. Now they have a chance to kick a field goal by missing that shot. Yeah, especially at this spot in the field. He's yeah, got to some lot of things. Come up with that INT. So put another three on the board. <laughs> All funny. things considered, a good opening drive to begin the third quarter. And as a defense... The way that this game is going, That's you're terrifying. excited to see those points go on the board. Gives them a little bit of leeway to 20 0 right now, boys. Let's go. I'm excited to see their offense score. Now they get to go out there and do their part. Is he, is he got the X Factor X activated? The Indy offense at the line and He's amazing. In this game, a chance for the offense, though, to put something on the board, get some momentum here in half two. Try and get things kick started for them. And you know at the half they discussed how they were going to get He's what you call a true God player. How many plays do you script coming out of the most, most of the time in the first half you're scripting 12 to 16. I think in the second half you're really scripting more like 8 to 10. Kind of a starter or an opener, whatever they whatever terminology they use. Just something to get you off to a quick start. Uh, get that pick! Now, oh! What'd you say, Jim? But it winds up falling incomplete. Eric Ebron, the big tight end, is intended target. And that'll bring up second down. Here's Brissett. And his pass incomplete. Atticate. Why would they run for the fourth and two? The route tree about as Not the ball and effectively all. as we right, could have possibly imagined. But sometimes the passes just go awry. Yeah, let's face it. When you're running the route tree in pregame, you don't have defenders breathing down your neck. You don't have defensive backs making plays on the football. Hard to replicate the intensity of the game in pregame. Indianapolis moving the chains here on this. a gain of 12. So now first and 10 as they've crossed into Miami territory at the 44-yard line. Now a fake on the give here as they try the run pass option. And shutting him off, now open field. Touchdown, Indianapolis. Antonio Brown. His third touchdown. Antonio Brown just shook us. And the Colts 
Pats are able to cut into this lead. He caught a nasty RPO. Shook a bunch of people. Get it to him, let him do the rest. You know, he probably said that to his quarterback as he broke the huddle. I like the play call. Just get it to me. I'll take care of the rest of it. Helping out his rack, right? R.A.C. <laughs> right catch, I'm glad he didn't fumble, I guess. carry that in at contract time. Goskowski with the extra point. And that cuts oh, this lead. Man. He's not supposed to be in. This is taking about seven yards deep. That's why he fumbled. And that's not and supposed he's to be able to get it across the 20, but not by much, as he's marked down at the 21 yard line. We got to start feeding my man Out comes the Pittman Miami Jr. Unit now. They get set to take over. And he ain't, fortunate to get points on the he ain't got no catches on the really season. To do so. the kickers in Let's go, Gus. Keep so giving them yards, so boy. And hit from distances that we almost start to take them for granted. Mm -hmm. And we can't do that. I like it. I like it, Gus. I like the way you're playing right now. Of. They've got to feel good about that. And they better make sure they love him up because he's helped them out. Yeah, now we'll see if that offense can put six on the board here. We'll see. On second down. Taysom Hill, QB blast. Heavy he's hands. taken down, but able to slip across the 35. Here we go. Here we go. The Miami first down, go. that one going for a game of 11. <sighs> and this is an example of breaking Josh down Allen's the defense. Josh Allen's so fast. A lot of these runs, he's getting past the point of attack. Uh, and guess what he's doing? Forcing the secondary guys to have to make a lot of tackles. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Edwards now on first and 10. And this time they were waiting for him as he'll be knocked down before he can get back to the line of scrimmage. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and 10. And now Jackson will look to throw it. This to Hines on the drop off. And this will be good for a pickup of nine to the 46. They had the catch on second down, but it didn't help at all. And now they're looking at third down here. Back now in Indianapolis. It's Dolphin football. It's also Dolphin lead to begin quarter number four. Oh, Breed is done for the year. On third down, oh, shit. <laughs> and he will have the first down as he's back down but, uh, up near it's not midfield. Brandon, when a defense just simply can't get no. off the field on third down. When I said substitute him out, apparently they're like, oh, we're going to keep him in on Wildcat. Though. You often feel like you're just a step behind whatever they're doing offensively. And one of the Two, uh, in this game. Oh! Fucking hell! Oh, it was just a late pick. Oh, boy. And the return this time will yeah. come out to the 42-yard line. Parker well, he was hurt. And it was a high risk of injury. When he came back in and got hurt again, so it's like, oh, he's probably going to be the long drive, but not just that. They had a great air attack going. Do they stick with that? I would think that they would, because if they were confident enough to do it on the last drive, starting backed up in their own territory, why would you change anything? They've got to be confident about what they're presenting and continue to do so. Yeah, because the secondary, they really look clueless. And that was amazing because that drive went and went, no adjustments and no big plays by the defense to knock the ball away. A 14-yard gain for Indianapolis and also moved the sticks. We're set now. Six for six. Oh, and shit. Back out of the locker. I messed that Nowhere one up. to escape, and he goes down. Give the sack to Jerome Baker. The amount of sacks that they've absorbed in this game is absolutely extraordinary. Let's just face it. This offensive line, flat out, cannot handle this pass rush. It's been demonstrated time and time again. Under four to go now as the clock runs, and they come That's up on second down. With set. Ebron with it over the middle. They get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. And after that completion, you can understand why so many teams in the league are emphasizing speed on defense at every position. The tight ends have created so many tough matchups now. If you can't run with a tight end as a linebacker, this is going to be the result every time. And brought down, but not before they're oh, inside the 25. That's good for an Indianapolis first down on a gain of 10. Brissett going to lead his guys up first and 10. And he's four for four now, throwing the ball to start the drive. Brissett sets to throw it. Caught here by Bell. 
It'll be a gain of eight yards, and it'll make it second down. Facing a second and two after that last catch, good for eight yards. They'll throw again, Brissett. And this is intercepted, and that should do it. Picked off by Tease Tabor. Partner, we always talk about possessions being at a premium in these games, and now in this situation, Ooh, throwing an interception 11 here, rushes, when you have to yards. claw your way back in, that one's going to hurt, and in a big way. They'll start on the ground with Hines. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. So the Dolphins have it as we welcome you back in. And you'd have to figure they're just looking to burn these final two minutes away and get out of here with a victory. And now right out of the two-minute break, we'll get a timeout used defensively with a minute 56 to go. Now this is a big third down, and you'd have to think we'd see a timeout right away if they can't stop him here. Again, it's Edwards. Well, this is going to depend on the spot, but it's not a very generous one. He looks to be about a yard or so short. And whistles, and we're going to have another stoppage of play as they call the timeout on defense with 1.53 left. Fourth down, here's Jackson. And this is Parker, complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. Not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and ten. Now a give, right side. Hines, and I think this defense knew what was coming as he is smothered behind the line. A loss of two there, second down. On this day, the ground has been his, oh, but dear. at least on that individual play, we just saw the defense finally with a win. Yeah, they finally got one, and that's a win for them, but all game long, he's seen the holes, and they've been huge for him. Kind of like a baseball hitter, in the zone, the ball seems bigger, and he's just whacking it. These guys, they've got it going today. On third down, it's Hines, and he's going to be taken down here still a couple yards short of the first. Just a gain of two there, and it's going to bring up a fourth down. This late in the game, Charles, I think you maybe seriously have to think about going for it. Especially where they are in terms of field position, because this is almost like no man's land. Might hurt your punter because there might not be enough space, maybe too far for your field goal kicker. I, I'm like the old rule. Possession is nine-tenths of the law. Possession is nine-tenths of winning the game. Go for it. Get the first down. Close it out. And he has got it from 55 yards away. That was never in doubt. So they settle for just the three, but clearly right Todd, now, are you done with your game? To uh, I got like 20 seconds. I'm on defense. I got like 20 seconds left. Been the final nail to finish this thing off, but they still ate up time. 15 seconds points. left. I'm sorry. So, While well, it's not mission accomplished, it's darn close. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. The Indy offense at the line and set to go. They have a little bit of time left here, but this one not going to go their way. And this is where, in this situation for me, you just go ahead and run out the clock, shake hands, congratulations, and move on. Because now, <laughs> you're not going to make up for what's happened during the game in this last sequence. We'll see what they do here in this last sequence. They're throwing to start the drive, but that one incomplete. Let's bring it. A second down throw for Bussell. He's going to let it fly. And that will be incomplete as time has run out on this football game. All right. So a victory here Got the, for the dub. Miami Dolphins. And they were the spurred on by a strong comes. performance in that fourth quarter as they held their opponents off the scoreboard. Everyone wants to pitch a shutout for the entire game. But when you throw one in the fourth quarter, that tells everyone that you're getting stronger. 
and dominance is starting to take over, right? The way that you close, the way that you finish, that gets preached to you from the time you're playing Little League football.